the Monaro. Oh, oh what a wow. move! By Welcome back to Bathurst Diecast Racing for the final of the semi-finals. Two more races to go. It's a gorgeous day and I'm joined by Harry. Say hi, Harry. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Bathurst Diecast Racing again. And the sky is clear. Yeah. No clouds in sight. Absolutely gorgeous. And we got these gorgeous beasts rolling around. We've got the, uh, the Holden Hand Grenade. Take it away, Harry. Thanks, Larry. We have the Holden Sandman, 121 grams. It is heavy. Mr. Mojo One from Bathurst Starcast Racing. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. The Oz wheels, and it's beautiful. The Nissan Sylvia S15, 84 grams. Drivers, Mr. Mojo Two from Bathurst Starcast Racing once again. There's lots of Bathurst Starcast Racings here. The 87 Sierra Cosworth, 88 grams. Mr. Mojo from Bathurst Starcast Racing. Absolutely beautiful. Miles an hour. <laughs> He's number 87. Uh, a Ford GT40, 51 grams. Ratsack from Big Sack Racing. Good luck, Ratsack. I hope you go well against these heavyweights. It's uh, proven to be a fast car in the past. Let's see if he can pull it together today. The track temperature is, mate. Here we go. Come on. Come We're getting on. there. There we go. 38 degrees Celsius and 100 degrees Fahrenheit. So, yeah, yet again, 100. Yep, that track, is, that track is always warm. Regardless, winter just gets extra hot in summer. All right, let's get to the top of the mountain and watch these beauties roll. Sandman in pole, Mr. Mojo to the right. We might just call the uh, the models and the Mr. Mojos. Yeah. All right, Ratsack's looking for a spot for the Sandman. Oh, wow. Oh, he does get to lose it a bit there, but the Sandman's out in the lead. Hey, little buddy. Wow, a lot of little buddies here. <laughs> wow, where'd they go? Oh, oh no. The Sandman's oh, no. getting wild. Sierra's right up behind him. Ratsack's coming in for a quick finish. Sandman oh, looks like wow. he went up on two wheels there. He did. Oh, that's what we like to see. Sam Sandman across the line doing a 360. Look at Ratsack. We'll, we'll get a replay in a second. We're just looking at the cars going round. Look at this. Very close. Gets yep. hit. Turns on his. Turns right. Yep. On his side. And then gone through the forest of birdies. Oh, <laughs> sideways for the Sierra, left and right for the Sandman, and here goes Sandman again. Goodness wow, look gracious, at that. he's just, he's going wild. Who put those speed humps down, Conrod? Oh, and he gets lifted up by the Sierra. And then Ratsack. the Sylvia, Sylvia right in the rear. Ratsack really far back there, but you'll see in a second. The Nissan Sylvia slows down, and then look at that drift by Ratsack. Very Beautiful. nice. Well done. Now watch this. He bumps up. <laughs> oh, look, whoa. <laughs> I did not see that. I was focusing on this, which Ratsack just gets through the Nissan Sylvia here. Well done, Ratsack. But two wheels. Whoa. Well, whoa. I think he's had more wheels off the ground than uh, he, on the ground then. Did he bend? His car bent. <laughs> well, he bent his car, I can tell you that. So it's a 902, a 911. 9.27 and 9.40, it's only 0.38 before, between everyone. Mr. Mojo 1 with 5 points, Mr. Mojo 3 with 4, Ratsack with 3, and Mr. Mojo 2 with 2. Alright. <laughs> this is going to get confusing. Yeah, we'll Ratsack be right. Ratsack and pole, there's oh. the Dino Dog again. Yep, he, uh, well, oh. he's leapt over, <laughs> leapt over the track. He's out of here, he's going, you guys are driving too dangerous for me, but uh, Ratsack clearly out in the lead, just as beautiful. Showing what he can do here. Oh, that hand grenade's right for that um, that Sandman. It's just waiting to explode. Third on Forest Elbow. Oh, there's a hand grenade too. They're everywhere. Here's the dog, and there's the dog. Jeez, that was quick. Super dog. And down they come. Rat sack out in the lead. Clearly. Oh. Is it me or is that Tassie Devil in the middle? It, uh, it is. And the hand grenade exploded. But it is Ratsack. Oh, oh no. no! Not Ratsack. And another Tazzy Desert as well. Oh. What has happened? Have we just got like... Is 
has Bathurst got a waterhole here somewhere and we're like in the middle of the desert? Well, we are in Australia. I think Australia Zoo left their gates open. (laughs) But, um, yep, that Sandman getting wild. So is the Sierra. Sandman getting wild here again. Oh, Oh my goodness. Nice little kookaburra there. And look at this. And then this is Sylvia. Oh, wow. Hang on a second. Yep. The Holden. Yep. It stops. And then no touching. Well done by the Sylvia. Uh, Sierra. (laughs) And big sideways here for Ratsack, thinking he had it all sewn up. Oh, but he just doesn't. And look at that. Just barely a touch. Only touches him. I think he doesn't. Maybe he does. No, he he does. He nicks him, but the Sierra gets past really cleanly. So it's a 9.18, 9.32, Ratsack really unfortunate there, post-tyre, and uh, the hand grenade pre-tyre. Mr. Mojo 3 with 8, Mr. Mojo 2 with 7, Mr. Mojo 1, and Ratsack with 5. There we go, 3, 2, 1, Ratsack. Right. 3, 2, 1, Ratsack. And away we go. <laughs> we go. <laughs> Great timing there. Oh, it's a big close group here. The um, Sylvia's getting left and right. But uh, Ratsack out in the lead again. Can he keep it? Gets pushed sideways, but does keep it. Well done. And the Sandman on the outside of the Sylvia. Oh, there's Dino Dog again. Oh, thanks, Harley. We didn't need to hear that. And up. There goes the Sandman again. Oh, no, that crocodile. But Ratsack, yes, well done, Ratsack. Well done. Look at all these animals. Platypus on a platypus. It's a platypus sandwich. (laughs) There was a uh, crocodile. Yeah, that little wombat, so wombat, I think you need to... Better move, wombat. Better move away. But, um... Oh, Harley's got some diarrhea, that is disgusting. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, the, the Sandman getting wild, and look at the determination on Ratsack here to keep that position. And watch this wow, on the this. outside. Oh, the Nissan Sylvia, look at that. Trying yeah. to get past, but just... No, he got taken by... by uh, it doesn't work. The Sandman. He uh, got jammed again. up again. Bendy car. Again. Yep. Flips over. On his roof. Oh. Ooh. Sylvia pushes Owie. his way past and says, Excuse me, I've got a race to try and finish here. Ow, that would hurt. And the Sandman on his side. But it is Ratsack across the line in the GT40. So Ratsack with a 913. Mojo 2, 951. And post tyre for 3 two. and 1. Mr. Mojo, would, Mr. Mojo 2 with 11. Ratsack with 10, same as Mr. Mojo 3, also on 10. Mr. Mojo 1 with 6. It's very close here. Oh, there's someone escaping in the background. Ronaldo, is that you? Is that really <laughs> you, Ronaldo? I believe that was Gary <laughs> making the way, but look at Ratsack looking for the move on the Sylvia. Oh, Sylvia wow. manages to just keep ahead. Whoa. Oh, it's all tight again. Big slap, door, door handle to door handle there. And a big Oh, the Sandman trying to look on the outside of the Sylvia. Look how close this is. Oh, oh Sylvia comes through. Oh, no, the Wombat. No. Did he get it? Oh, the Wombat got Ew. eaten by the by the Ferrari? By the Crocodile. <laughs> He's not a horse. Oh. Wow, this is really, really tight coming through here. The poor, the poor Wombat. So Sylvia's on the outside here going door to door with the Sandman. And then the Sandman trying to make the move up the inside. The Sylvia says, no way, Mr. Mojo. Mr. Mojo, you're not getting through, Mr. Mojo, Mr. Mojo. Then Mr. Mojo here. <laughs> <laughs> her all what? nose to tail. Well, Sierra loses it, and the Sylvia on the outside. Is that a bunny getting eaten by another crocodile? Yeah, well, it's, it's uh, you got to eat. And then the Sylvia. Well, well Bathurst Diecast Racing, spelled backwards, is if, not really... But still, anything can happen. What? Well, all right then. So it's Mr. <laughs> Mojo across the line with the 910 and the Sylvia. 914, 923, and Ratsack post tyre. Poor Ratsack. Mr. Mojo with two. Uh, Mr. Mojo two with 16. I keep doing that. Mr. Mojo with three with 13. Ratsack 11. Mr. Mojo one with 10. But it doesn't matter because the Nissan Sylvia, 84 grams. That is a bit of heavy. Mr. Mojo. One, two, or three, who knows? BDI advancing to the next round of semi-finals. And only two winners today. Cristiano White and the Essex boys picked the Sylvia. Nobody gave it a chance, but um, tell you what, pretty determined to get all the way through there. I, he, I think he come from third to first in that last race, so yep, well done no to Mr clouds. Mojo. Oh, hang on, there's a little bit of clouds over there. Yeah, a little bit of light smattering of clouds up there. 
But once again, look at that gorgeous sign. Such a professional oh, so YouTube good. channel. And the final. The final race. Only befitting that the two gorgeous Tiranas are here. But we Ooh, got others, so beauty? take it away. Toyota Sora? Sora? 87 grams, Mr. Mojo 1, Bathurst Dark Ice Racing. This. That is a nice car. Yeah, well, I'm sorry, it's not quite as nice as this. Nice as this, the A9X Tirana. What a beast. 83 grams, Mr. Mojo 2, Bathurst Diecast Racing. And speaking of beast... The pink Holden, Holden Monaro, 90 grams, Mr. Mojo 3, Bathurst Diecast Racing. I've got to go for that one. Yep, that's we the have, Oz wheel. We so. have a lot of Mr. Mojos, so... Yep, we'll just go the pink. Take one out. And <laughs> the other A9X, 75 grams, driven, driven by Peter Brock. For Bathurst Diecast Racing. The one that we all want to win, except me, because I like the pink one. Actually, I'm going to go for the Toyota. It looks nice. Oh, okay. And well, the Toyota's nice. race is now ruined. Thank you very much, Harry. <laughs> so it's 101 degrees Fahrenheit and 38 degrees Celsius. Still right. warm. Oh, can't wait to see these things rolling around the track. It's going to be absolutely gorgeous. And We're we'll... getting closer to finding the king of the mountain. We're ready to be... go. Can it be one of these cars? Well, Who knows? you never know. It might be. There's a lot of cars to go. And away they go. A9Xs both in first and pole. And they're looking like it's pretty even. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's kept there's it together. Two, there's two Tiranas. I don't know what to say. The <laughs> Tirana number one with Marlboro on the back. Just sit back and soak it in. Look at them go. Oh, wow. Very, very Look at tight. All those dogs. There's a lot of dingoes there. That dingo's got my vehicle. And it is the A9Xs going across the line in first and second. Absolutely beautiful. The Monaro in third. And the Sora in fourth. That crocodile is still munching on that wombat. Yeah, well, it takes him a little while. No one's going to try and stop him because the wombat shouldn't have been inside the... If near the mouth of him. But look at the sideways here from the A9X. Just rough. Wow. Really rough coming through there. Oh, Getting oh look loose. at that drift. Overcooks yep. it. Yep. Goes backwards. But it is, <laughs> it'll be uh, Mr. Mojo across the line. We have the 905, Peter Brock in second with the 911. Mojo 3, 948 in the Monaro, and 959 for the Sora. Mr. Mojo 2, 5 points, Peter Brock with 4, Mr. Mojo 3 with 3, and Mr. Mojo 1 with 2. All right, I'm glad the numbers don't match their points. Oh, someone's There's escaping again. Thanks very much for getting a wriggle on there, young fella. There's a gudgery bar. Yeah, and oh, the two Tiranas have caught themselves up. That leaves it for the Monaro and the Sora. They stopped. They tried to make one car out of two. Oh, look at that sideways by Mr. Mojo and the Monaro. Absolutely stunning. Way he goes down, Conrod. We're getting very close here. He's trying to catch up, but I think the Monaro's got too much for him. Extra couple of cylinders, well, four of them. And it is the Monaro across the line. That is nice from the Monaro. I wonder how long does it actually take for a wombat to get eaten by a crocodile? Oh, you never Maybe. know. Never know. I've never asked one. Two never hours. smiled at one either. <laughs> but look at these Tiranas getting caught up with each other. Oh, and then Shows they're very well close paced together when they get that close. Watch down by the, um, the crow there, but this big sideways by the Monaro, just beautiful. Watched by a couple of kangaroos, and across the line, it's Mr. Mojo. Look at this. Wow. Yeah. Who, who's the one with the um, Marlboro? Uh, that the is wing? Mr. Mojo. Peter Brock is behind there, so pretty box yeah. pre-tire. So Mr. Mojo with a 917, the Sora with a 929, and as you can see, the both A9Xs didn't make it across the line. Mr. Mojo 3 with 8, Mr. Mojo 2 with 6, Mr. Mojo 1 with 6, and Peter Brock with 4. So it's 3... Two, one. <laughs> well done. Peter Brock. All right. Peter Brock. <laughs> now. Oh, oh, Dino, Dino Dog. the track inspector's running around there. The Scrupneer, the Tirana, and the Sora getting side by side. But that leaves once again for the Monaro to just say, this is all mine, boys. Oh, Peter's getting left and right behind the Sora. Look at all those bunnies. And Peter, is he going to get him up the inside? Big slide by the Monaro. Does Peter oh. get him? Oh, oh this is wow, neck and neck all the way side. through. So and he oh, does. Oh, wow. Well done, Peter. Gets past. Beautiful. But not for me, though. Because, like, I went for him. 
Yeah. Look at Dino Dog running around the track going, I'm inspecting this whole track before they all get down. I actually think he was racing the cars there, and at the end he went, I win. <laughs> and look at this. Look at them all together. Just a stunning sight. So I'm taking a photo of that. Yeah, not so fantastic here for the Sora getting caught up. Ooh. Well, if he keeps getting hurt, he's going to get Sora and Sora, is it? <sighs> Make sure he doesn't fly. And, and here goes through the sky. <laughs> and here goes Peter. Sees the opportunity. He's getting jumping in his slipstream. Gets up the inside. The saw is trying to block him. Cannot side, do it. Side by side. Drifts again and yet overcooks it. Yep. Yet again. Yep. Those tires are getting pretty hot by the rear there. But look at this. Oh, side by this. side all the way through the chase. Oh. Sora still tries just slightly ahead. Look at it. And then Sora tries to bit maneuver him. Yeah. But I he think. seals the deal, gets the full vehicle in front, and it's Mr. Mojo. Seals the envelope. The Monaro across the line with a 928, Mojo 1 with a 932, Peter Brock and Mojo 2 both 10 plus. Wow. That was tight. Mr. Mojo 3 with 13, Mr. Mojo 2 with 10, Mr. Mojo 1 with 8, and Peter Brock with 7. Three times, it's 3 2 1. Oh, there you Three go. times, I'm still counting. Dino Dog again, looking at the cars, going, Is someone going to come out and see this? He's barking at someone there. I think he's barking at Harry by the look of it. And it is Mr. Mojo in the Tirana out in the lead. Just getting wild again. Slows everyone up. A little bit of a knock there with the Sora. And the Monaro is just waiting going, you guys are going to do something here in a second. I'm going to take advantage. Oh, there's a big stack. Someone's rolled over. Look at the Monaro. Oh, oh what a wow. move by the Monaro. That was absolutely stunning. That is going to go on the front. He could <laughs> he could sense something was going on there. Look at him, he's just waiting. Just Look. waiting for his opportunity. With his Monaro tingle. He's, <laughs> he's pink tingle. If only it was Peter though. Peter <laughs> tingle. Very good. Only if Peter was And a 2 a 9 is all four wheels off the ground. And oh, this is where it all cool. goes wrong Flips for Mr. Over. Mojo goes on his side does he block him up here on like does he go sideways oh, no he just they're all sliding along together no, but look at that i don't even think the monaro yeah. touched the sora there don't play don't pick your soras and the monaro is across the line let's look at this carnage wow yeah it's mr mojo in last place there with peter brock on his lid you don't see that too often so, Mr. Mojo in the Monaro with a 928, Mojo 1, 932, Peter Brock 10 plus, Mr. Mojo 10 plus. Mr. Mojo 3, 13, Mr. Mojo 2 with 10, Mr. Mojo 1 with 8, Peter Brock with 7, yet again 3, 2, 1, that's 4 times. But it doesn't matter because the whole of Monaro at 90 grams, which is kind of heavy, Mr. Mojo from Bathurst Dark Horse Racing is advancing to the next round of the finals. Well done to Oz Wheels for that, that model, so congratulations to Chris Hood. The Sparky, Mary Jean Joshua, Big Keg, JJ Brown, and Cull Coon. Okay, that's All... what it is. <laughs> we got it right now. Kick Goodyear, Miami Rose, Golfer Dude, RC Recreation, Ratsack, and rounding off the table here, Nettie and Sam Kitchen. Not one person got a double header. That's the first time in I don't know how long that we didn't get a double header. So to the YouTube's leaderboard, it's Chris Lord. Hood on 44. Big Keg, Nadine's Thermy Kitchen and RC Recreation all on 42. Numbskull sharing 41 with Red Trucks and the SX Boys, 35. Puffs Racing, 32. Miami Rose with 31. Kick Goodyear, 30. Ratsack, 29. And then Golfer Dude, 28. Shaggy, 27. Brian Sarkar's Thailand, 26. Oh my gosh, 32, yeah, 31, yeah. 30. Yeah, it's yes! All, it's all counting up. Yes. Yeah, that's absolutely amazing. Make it five times. That that <laughs> racing was amazing. That that Sandman, it's wild. I, I think the, the the nickname Hand Grenade's gonna gonna stick with that one. Uh, great work from Oz Wheels there, and the Monaro with the Oz Wheels in the second one, just spectacular. Some close moves there. Overtakes after accidents, barely touching each other. That's just just fantastic action. Unbelievable. I think well worth it for the final race of the semi-finals. And uh, so that means network next week, we're getting to the pointy end, the finals actually begin. I'm wow. so looking forward to this. We've been waiting a, only a year and a half or so uh, <laughs> for this, but um, and, but there's still plenty of races to go because yes. 
we'll, I'll put out a video with all the drivers for you to check out who they are. That won't be a you choose. It's just so everybody knows who's racing. We've got a few wild cards in there as well, uh, just to ensure that everything's sort of balanced up. I tried not. We, we tried not to have uh, teams running against teams um, to separate them all up. But after these set of finals are done, which I believe is about 20 races, it'll be randomised completely. And if it's two teams against the same drivers from the same teams against each other, that's just the way the cookie will crumble. But and, um, and, the, and it will make it two, the top two of the finals go through. So yes. let's see how many spotos there are in the final as well, because yeah. you named a lot of spotos. And Mr. Mojo's. So yeah. Mr. Mojo, you got a big workload. We're not paying you double. We're just paying you normal. Amount. Well, I guess that's the beauty of being the owner of the track. You can put as many as you like in. But that is it for now. There's no more, no more um, uh, free throws coming in. Everybody's had their go. It's been absolutely fabulous. Uh, all the qualifying and semi-finals up to now, and um, I can't wait for the finals. I've got to say this: Belgium Grand Prix. Just watch it. Trust me. Eau Rouge is going to be amazing. Anyway. Yeah, that Eau Rouge yeah. is a, a ridiculously good it corner. It is crazy. All right. Well, until next week, my name's Larry. And my name's Harry. And you've been watching Bathurst Diecast Racing. Racing.